everyone, Alvira here. I hope everybody's having a blessed weekend. Um, I thought I'd show you what I'm going to make for lunch. Uh, next couple days I'm making a big pot of fresh vegetables, but this time it's a little different. And I'll have the calorie count, of course, for you. We've got some fresh celery, some carrots, tomatoes, parsley, cilantro, squash, cucumber, potatoes, and zucchini. And we're going to use three pieces of fresh ginger because we're going to make our own broth this time because I don't have any broth but I want to have soup for lunch so we're going to throw these in the pot just like that we got some fresh garlic and we'll start chopping away I got a ton of stuff here to chop I uh, came through yesterday and Went shopping today, I just relaxed. Yesterday I would have been on, but I had to clean my house. I'm pretty efficient when it comes to house cleaning. I like stuff, I have like things I like to do every month and I make sure it's done and. today but that's okay it's just been a rough it wasn't really a bad weekend I just work's been so busy that I just get tired and I want to have lunches and I don't really go out to lunch because I don't like to go to um, out to eat because I never know what people put in their food and I don't want to have to, you know, I just had that happen to me the other day. I'm allergic to pork and somebody gave me pork and I got sicker than a dog. And it was like, uh, no, we're not eating that no more. They didn't realize it and I tried to tell them. That's why I try not to really go anywhere to eat unless I know. Because I don't really know what people put in and I got to really, really... Keep, um, we're trying to chop here. And I'm not using any um, thing that's not fresh. Everything is fresh. Some I went to the farmer's market, the other I got at Myers. I just know that for lunches, for work, I gotta have lunch. And I don't like to go out to eat because I'm always busy and I got a lot to accomplish each time I'm at work with what I do. So, plus I work out and stuff. And work's really busy right now. And I uh, just think that it's great when you can eat healthy and you can, um, you know, count your calories, but also you can cook healthy. And it's not like you have to go out and spend all this money. I mean, I spent to the grocery store today, I had like $106, I ate a bunch of coupons. By the time I was done, I paid $95 out the door and I got a lot of food. And I got vegetables, I got meat, because they have a fresh meat counter at Fire that I love. And um, got a bunch of chicken and, and stuff. And I 
always try to eat healthy because, I mean, sometimes I screw up, but very rarely, because if I do, I feel it, and then I get sick, and so I really try to eat, stay healthy and eat healthy all the time. I mean, sometimes I'll cheat and have a pizza, but I only go to certain places for the pizza, you know, stuff that I know that I can have, and... And I got some fresh cabbage at the produce store. We're also gonna use zucchini noodles for noodles. So I'll show you how I'm making those in a little bit. And, and the thing I like about freshness, too, is that the vegetables, you know, there's no preservative. You know, basically, it's all fresh. It came right out of the garden. It's been a gorgeous weekend, though. It's been wonderful with the weather, and got my house clean. I got ready for work, and today I'm doing my cooking so I can and doing bedding at the same time. So if you hear the buzzard, it's my dryer. Sorry, and uh, getting my lunches ready for work. Hands again. Oh. A lot of chopping here.
sorry. Since I'm out of broth, I'll show you how I, you know, you can make broth, and, you know, sweeten it up or have a good taste of broth um, and stuff without, you know, when you don't have a container of broth. And I also, you know, a lot of times, I always try to eat as healthy as I can and take my food everywhere, you know, um, and cook. I do go out to eat, but very rarely anymore because it's getting to the point where it's very hard for me. And I really have to know what people are putting their food because I've been get, I've gotten sick before. So it's like, nope, I have to really know what you have because I don't want to... Um, get sick after I've already had it happen to me. I'm going to break and I'll be right back.